uh, Heathrow or Conbrook Immigration Removal Centre. Now, this is quite an important topic at the minute, with obviously a lot of what's going on with the with the, what the Home Secretary, uh, some of the words the Home Secretary has been saying and things like that about immigrants with all the situation with immigration hotels. So I thought I'd come down here today. I know a few auditors have been here previously. So this is Homebrook Immigration Removal Centre. Let's walk straight up. I think people are going in at the minute. There's the uh, custody vans for the uh, immigrants. I thought the, the prison vans for immigrants. Let's have a little walk over here. Now, no drone here, it's right next to Heathrow Airport. But staff entrance here, leaving the door open. Oh, it's closing. It's closing. All right, for now, a half is not allowed out of that training. Yeah. It's a pass all around. <laughs> they know what's going. They know the. They know the drill here. Immigration and Asylum Act. Conveys in and out. Uh, anything uh, convey anything out of a detention centre or to a detained person? Huh. It's guilty of an offence into this paragraph. So I haven't actually been in. Been out in public. Well, out in public, the accessible areas. Should we say? Let's see what's in here. So that's the staff staff area, I think, as well. Where's this door wide open? So we're not going in. We're going to stand outside. We want to have a look inside because they've left the door open. Oh, it's lighted. All right. Yeah, not bad, are you? Yeah, well, what are you filming? Just whatever I can see. Yeah, can you just, this, this you can't film. If you want to film somewhere else, can't film somewhere well, else. Well, this yeah. public access shouldn't leave the door open, should you? Go away, man. You go away. <laughs> what? What? You're deaf, clearly. I can't hear you through that thick door, mate, can I? Not as thick as your head, though, is it? Crap. Slightly different rules to a prison because it comes under the Immigration and Asylum Act, not the Prison Act. But look at these. These are the prison vans. Oh, we've got a vehicle coming out. Oh, no wait. I think we might do, you know. Hiya, Captain. Oh, magpie. Seen a few today. My fair that door. Is that door opening? I thought that door was opening, it sounded like it was. Let's have a little look in here. Yeah, it looks just like a uh, looks exactly like one of the prison vans. Like Geo Amy or Circle or one of those. It looks exactly like it. These do. Heathrow Airport, right next to us. Oh, I know. Bet you're jealous, auditing Yorkshire. You're not seeing this, really. Huh. 
pool. Let's get into it. So there's quite a lot of these uh, custody vans around. Immigration custody vans. I don't know whether that's opening or not. It's Colnbrook and Harmonsworth, there's two. And they look exactly like prisons, but there's, apparently they're, they're treated like farm animals in there. But I know a lot of you don't actually care how immigrants are treated, but a lot of them don't come to this country not by choice. And that's what a lot of people seem to forget. So a lot of them don't have an option. Care plus custody. Base, so that's why they've got them over there. There we go. Where am I? Yeah, I thought the weather's nice, so I'd uh, come out and do this. Hi, hey, Captain. Yeah, look at the size of this. I only really wish I could take a drone here, but it's, I can't. It's flight restricted due to its proximity to Heathrow Airport. So we're going to have a look this way. Huge this place. Gonna bring up a bit of information in a minute. Come by the home office. Oh, there's someone over there, look. It's quite a big place, isn't it? Look, they've got the uh, HM Courts. Got a court building here. Right, got a court building here, look. HM Courts and Tribunal, or oh, Tribunals, that's what it's for. It's Tribunals. See, there's a Tribunal building here for Immigration Tribunals, look. So obviously this is an Immigration Removal Centre, so they have their, plead their case, and have their Immigration Tribunals held here. I'll record, yeah. Record what I like, thanks. What did you, what were you saying? Just having a look. Yes, I can. Yes, I, I'm not inside. I'm not coming in. I'm not coming in, no. Why, why did you think I was coming in? I'm not coming in. I know I can't record in there. I'm not coming in there. HM Courts and Tribunal Service. It's all part of the Immigration Removal Centre, though. Blimey. You can tell we're right next to Heathrow. Let's have a look inside. Oh, it's a control room, is it? It's a control room, yeah? Sick. Security. I'm recording outside, love. So I'll get that. Drug detection dogs in operation. So she's gone in there. Yeah? Look, they've got all the metal detectors and things like that, love. It's pretty cool. Well, I'm not going to come in there anyway, like. I'm not coming in there anyway. They're watching me, aren't they? He's on, he's on his... Oh, there's a vehicle coming out, look. Looks very official. Look at that very official looking vehicle coming out. Let's get a shot in there before it closes. Oi, what are you what? doing? Filming. What are you doing? What are you doing? Get out! What are you doing? Don't touch me! Do not push me! I will! 
Get out. No. Do not push me. What's the matter with you? You just assaulted me, you did. Absolute muppet. Just assaulted me. Who do you think she is? You knew she was going to assault me, didn't you? You saw that, didn't you? She assaulted me. Did you see her assault me then? What? Did you see her assault me? She physically assaulted me. Oh, the CCTV all around you, so it'll be on that. I got it on camera. I got it on camera, you assaulted me. I got it on camera, you assaulted me. Do never put hands on a member of the public, ever. Nothing. Colleagues just put hands on me. I'm not going to say anything here. Eh? Disgraceful. Who she thinks she is? Back in action. And there's a BT site literally right behind this place. Ah, didn't think BT were going to be just behind, did you? No. Nope. I'm only going where I can publicly access. That's the thing. What's this sign say? Parking, it's all about parking. So that's for BT. Oh, that's immigration there. Eh? It's part of this place. It's all part of it. It's huge. Look at this, look at the size of this. It's a massive place. Shall I take you on a full walk around of it? Got plan we're planning to do some asylum, some asylum, some uh, some uh, embassies today. Oh, it does say no trespassing there. Well, I didn't see that, and no one's asked me to leave, so... Jill. See you, Amy. One of your colleagues assaulted me. Think that's acceptable. Think it's acceptable that one of your colleagues assaulted me. I'm wanting contact. One of your colleagues assaulted me. Yeah. She was very aggressive. Well, because I was filming over there. Why did you not call the police then? Well, I will. I will inform the police. I will inform the police. I thought I could. I thought it could be dealt with in. I thought at first it could be dealt with internally. I said, care, care, care and custody you work for, isn't it? So if I, if, how would I make a complaint against someone? How would I make a complaint through your organisation? Could you advise me on how to do that? Or? Just call the police. Yes. All right, thank you. It's 
So they said the police will should deal with this. I don't know whether, with these being a government organisation, whether HNK will deal with this, but I will refer this to HNK. If not, I'll go to a police station and uh, I'll take it to them. But I can't believe this, can't believe this behaviour of immigration staff here at uh, Colnbrook. Well, those were all right. They were quite, that woman looked at me a bit funny, but it's in the immigration van, yeah, look. One of their vans. This is prime time to end it off now. So I'm going to stand here. I'm going to crack on with what I was doing and end off my video. That wasn't the lady, was it? So they're all bringing... I think they're doing a bit of work inside, I'm not sure. Don't film me, mate. Oh, I'm filming in public, mate. I don't care, don't film me. But I'm allowed to. Don't film me. I'm allowed to. I'm allowed to. So... I'm in it, I'm filming that van, so... Create privacy if you want it, mate, okay? Like I'm doing. All right. They're all coming out, aren't they? They're all on their radios, look. What's going on? So, I think we're gonna end this off now, this video. We're gonna hang about, because they're all coming out to see what I'm up to, I think. So we're gonna walk back the way I came which was this way. So we're going to walk back that way. There's a public footpath, which is what I've been taking. And then you can walk back through there to the pavement outside. So this is uh, Colnbrook Immigration Removal Centre. There's a lot of contractors here at the minute. Oh, they're all coming out. This has been a crazy, crazy one. This off. They're all going to that van now. It's the same, uh, same people I just spoke to. They're recording me as well, they didn't tell me. So another one. Blimey, how busy is this side? Huh. Don't know whether these go on the airport as well. <laughs> so yeah, that's been uh, Colnbrook Immigration Removal Centre. I think we're going to hang about for another, another minute just to see what's happening as they're all... My God. So yeah, I'm gonna step back this way, I think. So thanks everybody for watching. Um, I think I think they're all right, they're gonna leave me to it, to be honest. So, uh, thanks everybody for watching. Make sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And we'll see you all in the next one. TGA out.